Hi, this is Deb from Business Building Shortcuts, and in this video, we're going to go get for you a free FTP software. And what that is, File Transfer Protocol, FTP. And what that is, is a little piece of software that logs into your uh, hosting account. And it's the software that will move the web pages that you create from your computer to being live on the internet. So the one we're going to be using is called Coffee Cup. So if you just enter Coffee Cup into your, your Google search or whatever search um, engine you choose and, and click to go find it, uh, it will come up here under coffeecup.com. Then what you just want to do is go ahead and click on Coffee Cup software and it will bring you to their wonderful website. I'm just going to make it a little bit smaller here so we can see it more on here. And what we want is the um, coffee cup free version. So go under free stuff and the website might look a little different from this but somewhere on here is going to be the free stuff and so it will show you all these various softwares that they make available to you free of charge and what you want is the free FTP uh, whatever version it happens to be at the time. So just go ahead and click the free FTP and it will take you over to the download site and this is what it looks like. Now this is not a fancy FTP uh, program but it's basic and it will do the things that you need it to do. So what you want to do is just go ahead and click the download. Take it for a spin, no strings attached and you can put in your email here or not, it doesn't really matter, and click on download now and it will come up and ask you where you want to download it. So I would just go ahead and download it to my desktop. So I'm going to click on save file and um, navigate over to my desktop and it's going to come just as an application so it's going to be coffee free FTP installer.exe uh, when it downloads on your desktop. So I'm going to navigate over there. Hopefully your desktop doesn't look anything like this. And I'm going to download over and it's going to go ahead and save on my computer desktop. And then when that's done, then you just want to navigate over to it and double click that file. When you double click on the icon, just double click on it. It will bring up a file that looks like this and you would just click run. And it will come up and it will show you this. Now this is a little bit older version than the one you might be downloading but it should be very much the same. The first thing you need to do is to set up your server and so you would go ahead and click on the server and then it gives you a number of options and if you see this, this is our main website. This is our username and you would enter your username. Now these are the informations that you would have gotten when you set up your HostGator account. And then whatever password you used and then just click connect. And what this will do is it will take you online so that you can see the insides of your website online. So now what you have is on this side you've got your computer and you can navigate around in your computer and find files that you want to upload and you would do that by selecting a file let me navigate to one that is pretty small that I can show you and the way you would upload that is to go over here to your um, actual what's on your website and if this is your root domain if you only have one domain name on your website you would be entering um, uploading your data to this directory and and you would be putting it inside of your public HTML folder so you want to go ahead and double click on that now if you have add-on domains, each of those will be a folder inside here. So if I wanted to add something to our Business Building Shortcuts website, I would double click on that 
it would open up the site and I could go ahead and upload the page to that and I would simply do that by clicking on it on my computer side and clicking upload and see how quickly it transferred the file 3doc now when I go down here and look there it is just that fast now let's say you didn't want a file on your website you could go ahead and select it and right click it and choose delete and it will ask you are you sure you want to delete it and you would say yes and now it's not on your website any longer so this is your site you want to be very careful about what you do over here <laughs> because you can delete your whole site by accident <clears throat> and this site again is your computer side you identify the file you want to upload over here and then you would navigate to where you want to put it on this side and again it's either in public HTML if you only have one domain name you would be putting it there or otherwise you would have different folders inside for each of your other domain names that you have added as add-on domains and you would simply double click on those now some of them will have places for images PDF files and others um, but usually the good instructions comes along with whatever it is that you're downloading so that's how you will use your coffee cup free FTP program to upload your landing pages, squeeze pages, product delivery pages, and more to your new website.